The new YouTube Studio Beta, or the new YouTube Studio, has finally kicked in. And if you made a mistake and you wanted to go back and trim your old video, you need to know how to find it and how it works. That's what we deep dive in today, how to trim your YouTube videos in the new YouTube Studio. Here we go. Hello and welcome back to another video. I'm Alan Spicer, your YouTube certified expert. And if you're looking to start a YouTube channel, grow your YouTube channel, or push your brand out there onto the second largest search engine on the internet, you should click subscribe, start creating. We've all done it, we've edited a video, we've taken some care, some attention, we've uploaded it, we've ignored it for a little while, and then we've noticed there's a little error, a blank space, a fluff, or just generally something that you didn't want in the video. And it's so much effort dragging it down, deleting the video, re-editing it, re-uploading it, re-promoting it. You can trim it whilst live or trim it before it's even published using the YouTube Studio trim tool. But they have moved it from where it used to be in the classic mode. So I'm gonna show you how to find it in the YouTube Studio. Let's go to the computer. Okay, so this is the new YouTube Studio. What you need to do is go to the left hand side where it says videos. It will load this page where you get to see all of your video content. No doubt you've seen it before. And then you need to select the video you want to trim. In this case, we're going to use the this video here. So I click on the title. It will load you into this page where you normally put your title, your descriptions, your tags, your thumbnails, you choose the playlists. But we're focusing on the editor on the left hand side. Here is a nice swish new editing suite where you normally add end cards, information cards, that kind of thing. And you'll see here, trim. Now this thing will pop up at the bottom. It's a little blue box and it's part of the trimming tool. So you now scroll along by dragging to where you want to edit your video. So let's say we'll go for the two minute mark. There's nothing specific there, but I then click split. What that has now done is put a line there which tells YouTube that that part there, that part there are separate. And I can drag again to wherever I want. So once again, let's drag it to there. And I have the split option again, so I can split. I now have three parts of the video. One, two, three. Now in this case, I could choose what I wish to eliminate. So let's say I, I clump out that whole lot there, right? You'll see that it's showing next to the word edit trim, how long that space happens to be, how long the video would be, and how long it will be without it. Now, I click preview. Now, if I put it here, you'll see the blanked out bit. This is the bit that I wanted to delete, or I've told YouTube to delete. So just beforehand, if you watch the timer and it rolls forward, and it rolls forward, you'll see that that's the bit that I blanked out, and it jumped jumped across the way. That means that that's been eliminated. So that's no longer part of that video. And if I'm happy with how it jumped and I've watched it in this bit here, I can simply click save. It will say that it will make all of the changes for me and then it will render the video accordingly. And I click save and then it's done. You will need to give it a little bit of processing time, but when it is done, all of the processing tabs will be removed for you. So that's how you can trim your video, whether it is live or just uploaded, using the new YouTube Studio Trim Tool. If you need more help with any of the features on YouTube, I've done a playlist up here. And of course, you can hit that subscribe button for regular YouTube tricks and tip tutorials. Hit that bell notification icon so you're alerted every time I go live. Go out there, start creating.